We're back once again beside the St. Lawrence River here in Montreal for the Canadian Grand Prix. The event first moved to a variant of this track back in 1978. It was won by none other than Gilles Villeneuve, the first Canadian to ever win his home race and in whose honour the circuit would be renamed. We'll be seeing top speeds of around 210 miles an hour here at the circuit Gilles Villeneuve with around two thirds of the lap taken at full throttle. High speed chicane spell potential danger, especially at the infamous Wall of Champions. And watch out for overtaking into the hairpin and the final chicane. Anthony Davidson joins me again for the race today. Now I want to ask you about Daniel Ricciardo. That was a great win in the last race. Can they keep that momentum going this weekend? It's always nice to come into a Grand Prix weekend on a high, but your expectations are based much more on your practice and qualifying runs. So it's the momentum from those sessions that they'll be hoping to carry into the race today. We're almost ready to go then, and this is what the starting grid looks like for today's race. Sebastian Vettel has a clear track ahead of him today. He starts in pole position, and it's Lewis Hamilton alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Raikkonen, Bottas, Max Verstappen, and Ricardo, Holkenberg, and Williams, Alonso, and Sergio Perez, Sainz, Ocon, Kevin Magnussen, and Grosjean, Leclerc, Gasly, Stoffel van Dorn and Lance Stroll, Ericsson and Brendan Hartley rounds off the grid. Now it's almost time to lights out, so let's go down to the track. This is a really good starting position for us. Let's try not to lose it. Na zdi, a to ve veteřu nikam dej, kde se pokusím dáno co nejlépe uvozovka v další reparát závodu, který jsem totálně zvoral minulé díle v Monaku. Ostatní z místa osmého poprvé letos, myslím, jsem se probojoval do první desítky a tím pádem musím startovat už na těch poští z diplomatikách, na kterých jsem si kvalifikoval se.
some of this energy. Thank you. 
A new strategy is available from the MFT. Check your MFT for a new strategy option.
की शिकने सताच के
na přímo celé přední přítačné čudo. performance from Ferrari, it hardly looked in doubt. Anthony, what do you think made the difference here? Well, I'd, I'd say it's just raw pace, plain and simple. I mean, we could sit here and talk about strategy all day, the overtaking, looking after the tyres, but at the end of it all, if you want to win, you need a package that's got the speed over everyone else, and that's exactly what they had today. So, here they come now, out onto the podium. Wherever you go, anywhere in the world, the prancing horse flags are dominant in the grandstands, and they're out in force again today. It's Ferrari, on the top step once more.
And now let's take a look at the driver standings. Well, the lead at the top has come down after a poor result for our points leader. And now I'd like to ask you, Anthony Davidson, who was your driver of the day? I'm going to say Brendan Hartley. It was probably one of his best drives this season, and I was thoroughly impressed. And here's how things are shaping up in the Constructors' Championship. After all this drama, you'd be mad not to join us for the next race. We hope to see you then. Take care. a lot of paint on the walls today. Were you struggling for grip or did you just misjudge some corners? There was quite a lot of contact today, wasn't there? We've received invitations to new historic events. You'll be able to choose whether or not to participate before the end of this weekend. Jenom, jenom, že se si to objednal. 
To už je výrazně opotřebený. To tak moc, že mi hra prostě nedovolí tu součástku nasadit. Chtěl bych tak po druhém závodě 21%. Mám jeden víkend, ještě jeden víkend na to, abych získal až aspoň ještě dva body. Cílem pod tím byl tři body. A mám tady Checkpoint Challenge z Ferrari F2007, nebo osovku v Rusku. Já si myslím, že asi pojedu v Maďarsku, protože to je že závod v Rusku. Ve Francii bych měl být výrazně, výrazný počet uh, upgradeů na movu. We take a... I know we were expecting some new developments this weekend, but some of them have failed quality control. Make sure you indicate what you'd like redeveloped via the workstation. You can remove. Je 
máme za sebou čtyři hotové upgradey, ale redukce váhy aby to tohle se nepovedl. Včas jí mám ale výbornou mováko, přestože jako tým máme absolutně tu nejhorší šasí. V tréninku si zase nasesím vody. Stále máme nejhorší a hlinko a nejhorší šasí. Na druhý pokus by to se to už mělo vít. Máme spolehlivější, je sice jen o 30%, ale o 30% spolehlivější palovací motor a to je všechno, dámy a pánové. A děkuji, že jste se dívali. A zatím nasledanou.